Okay friends, I hope you have read the question. Now question is in front of us. We have plotted all the data and we need to find the area of triangle ABC. I am going to give you a shortcut which is applicable for SSC and CAT also. I would suggest if you are writing SSC CGL, please mug up this formula and apply this in the SSC CGL because you do not have time. You have 60 minutes and 100 questions. So if you know the formula, you can apply in your examination and get answer. So let's start with formula as well as concept. We have a smaller triangle that is 1 and this one is O and this one is 5. So our answer is what? These two triangles should be same and this one is nothing but 5 plus 1 upon 5 minus 1. If you have 1 and 5, this is only for the SSC. This one is only for SSC, CGL. If this will come in your examination, apply the same. If you have 1, condition applied, this would be 1. Then this would be nothing but 5 plus 1 upon 5 minus 1. That is nothing but 6 by 4. That is nothing but 3 by 2. So this one is 3 by 2. This one is 3 by 2. And this one is a square. That is 9 by 4. And this is an answer. That is 1.5, 1.5, 2.25. 5 plus 1 is 6. 1.1.5 1 is 3. 6 plus 3 9. Plus 2.25 is 11.25 is an answer. I am going to give you a formula. Aap ise rat lo. Apply in CGL. Agar aata hai, to apply kar do. I am not saying go for the CAT with the same formula. But if you get the same type of question in CAT, apply the same formula. If remember the formula. I will give you the concept also. Okay. And now formula is. If you have triangle ODE, area is 1. Condition applied should be 1. And this area is M. Any value. Then what should be the area of any triangle? The area of this triangle is nothing but M plus 1 upon M minus 1. Area of this triangle is M plus 1 upon M minus 1. And the area of this triangle is nothing but M plus 1 upon M minus 1 whole square. And if they ask to choose you or to get the value of any triangle, you have all the values. You have all the values in the term of M. Put the value of M and get the answer. I hope this one is quite easy if you know the formula. So let's solve a question. And question is in front of you. You have triangle ABC. BC is parallel to DE, area of ODE is 1 cm square, area of ADE is 3 cm square, then find the area of triangle ABC. I would suggest pause the video and solve the question. I hope you have solved the question. And the answer is, this one is 3, this one is 1. The area of this one is 3 plus 1 upon 3 minus 1, that is 4 by 2 is 2, this one is 2, this one is 2, this one is a square, that is 4. The summation is nothing but 4, 4, 8 and 4, 12. So the area of this triangle is 12 centimeters square because we know that is 1 m m plus 1 upon m minus 1 m plus 1 upon m minus 1 this is nothing but the m plus 1 upon m minus 1 whole square and this is an answer okay so i suggest if you are writing cgl please write lijes here i hope this one is clear to you you can stop this video here only but if you want to know the concept why it came m plus 1 upon m minus 1 i would suggest please be with me okay let's check the concept the first concept is the concept of trapezium we have discussed this in a length you can find the trapezium concept in the geometry playlist of our channel now the, what is the concept if this area is a this area is b then this area is nothing but root a b and root a b these two areas are same this is the first concept okay i hope this one is clear second concept is also of trapezium the triangle upper and triangle lower are nothing but similar. So we can say the base ratio, the base ratio, whole square is the area ratio. So we can say the area of upper say the delta 1 and the delta 2, delta 1 upon delta 2 is the base ratio say A, B, D, E. So we can say delta 1 upon delta 2 is nothing but the D upon A, B whole square. I hope this one is clear. Check the third concept. Third concept is also of similarity. If these two lines are the parallel, then a smaller triangle is similar to the bigger triangle. And the area of a smaller triangle delta 1 to the bigger triangle delta 2 is nothing but the base ratio whole square. I hope this one is clear. So we can say if we give the under root of the area ratio, we will get the base ratio. I hope this one is clear. So we have three concepts. One is of trapezium. A, B, root A, B, root A, B, another one of similar triangles in trapezium and the parallel lines. Now apply this in our question. So apply all three concepts in this question. We know 
ODE is parallel to BOC because these two triangles are similar. We know upper triangle ADE is similar to ABC because lines are the parallel. Assume the area is nothing but the x square. Why I have taken x square to get a simple value. The product of these two is the x square. This one is nothing but under root of 1 into x square that is x and x. So this is all our area. If the area ratio is 1 upon x square, so we can say the base ratio is nothing but 1 by x. So we can say DE upon BC is under root of the area ratio that is 1 by x square that is nothing but 1 by x. By these two triangles, now from a smaller triangle to bigger triangle that is ADE 2 upon ABC, we find DE upon BC is nothing but the area ratio of DE is 5 and that is complete one is the 6 plus 2x plus x square. Since both two are the ratio of DE upon BC, by equating these two, we can solve x is nothing but 3 by 2. I hope this one is clear. This is the concept. Now, how I am getting the formula? Here, I am not going to take any value. I am taking m. Assume this triangle area is x square. So, this one is nothing but x. This one is nothing but x. In a trapezium, we are going to apply similarity. We can say DE upon BC is nothing but under root of 1 by x square. Area upon area is 1 by x. Now, bigger triangle to smaller triangle, I am going to get value BE upon DE upon BC is under root of the upper triangle upon complete triangle that is M plus 1 plus 2X plus X square. Equating both, we can say 1 by X equal to M upon M plus 1 plus 2X plus X square. From solving this, we will get it is nothing but m plus 1 upon m minus 1 and this is our outcome. So, this is the concept behind all these questions. What happens? This one is not 1. We solve on the basis of ratio. We will discuss in the next upcoming question solutions video. I would say stay tuned and subscribe the channel. Thank you and happy learning.